it's amazing what you can accomplish in three days and two nights. Six years ago, I took a Harley trip with one of my close friends. His name's Mikey. My friend Rainer had never been to Montana. So Mikey and I decided to bring him on this trip with us. There's a few places that you travel in this world that you go see and visit and experience. But to me, those few places that you want to go back and bring your family or bring your friends is what really makes a place impactful in someone's life. You don't start riding motorcycles if you don't have like some kind of interest in getting out and adventuring. I feel like just Montana in general, it has so much to offer. Being able to see that from a motorcycle and then hop off and fish, it's pretty incredible. The second you get in the rhythm with where you're at, where you're going, everything starts to flow and that flow goes completely through your mind, your mind empties out and the experience, the adventure, the memories, you know, the way that you feel and the way that you're able to just let go and kind of be in a different space, that puts you in this place that is completely different than anything else. Like when you're on a motorcycle and you're cruising and like everyone's around you, you're just heading somewhere, but it's like nowhere necessarily important. You're just on your way there. But then when it's all over, you go back to the things that matter to you, but it gives you that fix of just feeling completely free. Motorcycles in general, they just hit different just hit different in the sense that you are completely disconnected from the things that bind you day to day. You're able to just live in this space where you can't answer your phone, you can't reply to emails, you can't text somebody back, you, it's just you, the throttle, your friends, and the open road, and it's just a mindset that does not compare to anything else.